So it's a place in QGIS. First of all, you need to have a base map on which you're going to make the search. So for that, you can go to plugins and manage and install plugins. Then here you have to search quick map services, this one. You just click install plugin so that you will be having or uh, getting a, a, an open street base map. Done. The plugin has been installed successfully. So I'm going to close this window and then you can go to web and here you will find quick map services. And among this list, you need to choose OISM. And from here you, ha you have to choose OISM standard. So this is going to be the base map on which you are going to perform your place search. So you can already see right the names of various places. So usually you manually zoom into your place of interest, your region of interest. But instead of that, there is a tool which will help you to search your place without this zooming in and out. So for that, you have to go to plugins again, then choose manage and install plugins. And here you have to search or as a place search this one and you have to click install plugins and just wait for a few seconds and this installation will be completed. Okay, now I'm closing this and the plugin has already appeared here and if it hasn't you can go to plugins and click OSM place select OSM place search and click click on this. So it will appear. So the first thing you have to do is you need to search your region of interest. So simply I'm going to search Mumbai. I'm going to type Mumbai in this box. And if you click here, the plugin will now be looking for your place of interest. Okay, I'm going to click again. Sometimes you'll have to click multiple times. Okay, done. So two Mumbai's have appeared. Uh, Let's double, if you double click on the name, uh, the, the map will be zoomed into that particular region. So I'm going to do that now. Okay, we have got Mumbai. Okay, I think the first one uh, consists of a small part of the Mumbai uh, city and I need the entire Mumbai region. So I will prefer this second one. So if I move my move my cursor, you can see the first one is a relatively small area and the second one contains the entire uh, city of Mumbai, the region, the whole region. So I'm going to double click on the second one. Again, okay, there is another tool. This is how you uh, search and find your, your uh, the places you want. And there is another option, which is uh, create mask from the, uh, from the selected object. So if you click there, see that particular area will be highlighted, your region of interest. And if you go to this uh, print compose, pr new print layout option and click OK. Actually, uh, you can draw the highlighted portion here by choosing this add map option and click and draw a box so that the Mumbai regions map will appear here separately and if you want to do further modification like adding coordinates adding a title adding grid cells and all I have already explained how to do that in one of my previous videos so you just check it out I have provided in the link I have provided the link in the description anyways let's go back and some of you might want a shape file or a vector file or a vector polygon for this region of interest for the Mumbai region. So how will you get that? How can you prepare a shape file? It's simple. There's another option called add object in new layer. So if you click there, a shape file or a vector polygon for the selected region will be created. So this is it. So this is the vector polygon corresponding to the Mumbai region or the region uh, which we selected. Okay, I'm zooming out and I'm simply going to search another place which is my hometown called Kanno. And if I click there, okay, we have got a lot of Kannos here. So this one is going to be it. So I'm going to double click. Yeah, see, this is it. And if I want, I, I can click there. And if I click 
uh, create mask then the area will be highlighted and also I can create a shape file by clicking add object in new layer see now I have also got a shape file for my region of interest so thanks for watching uh, I'll be back with another video soon